In this scenario, we are looking at a warehouse protected with a VXR dry system equipped with an accelerator. The VXR is a differential drive valve that operates on a mechanical advantage with a 6 to 1 pressure differential. The valve features minimal moving parts and can be externally reset. An accelerator is a device that speeds up the process of tripping a dry system. A slight but sudden drop in air pressure from an activated sprinkler will cause the accelerator to activate, redirecting air to the intermediate chamber of the VXR valve. This adds pressure to the valve's intermediate chamber, causing the air differential between the outlet and the intermediate chamber of the VXR valve to equalize. This will allow the inlet water pressure to overcome the air pressure in the outlet as air pressure continues to drop due to the activated sprinkler. In a scenario where a fire has started in the warehouse and begins to grow, sprinklers will operate. Air escapes through the operated sprinklers, causing the air pressure within the outlet of the valve, the trim, and pipes to drop. With the equipped accelerator, the slight but sudden drop in air pressure from the sprinkler operation causes the accelerator to activate and air is redirected to the intermediate chamber of the VXR valve, adding additional pressure under the clapper. Following the loss of air pressure, the low air supervisory alarm is activated. The lowered air pressure will cause the air maintenance device to open. This may trigger the air compressor to start. The decreasing air pressure over the clapper reduces the mechanical advantage within the VXR valve. Water from the inlet chamber of the valve pushes the clapper open and into the system piping. The water flow alarm is activated. Remaining air pressure in lines without sprinklers that have operated allows the flow of water to bypass those pipe branches and quickly reach the operated sprinklers. The sprinklers continue to control the fire until the fire department arrives. 